This is not gonna hurt. No. No, 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 no. Anyway. Can I just say we look fucking fantastic? What's up? Hey, hoes! <laughs> what? 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 We sound like seagulls. <laughs> you get a horse! That's if we dubbed the Nemo movie. What do they say? My, my, my. <laughs> Look, it's a fish! Mine. Horse, horse! <laughs> Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Oh, but not we... Sunday. Because the Lord's Day. My name's John Cook. What? <laughs> My name's Princess Diana. <laughs> oh, that's why you did that intro. And my dream house is the cheese boots Yeonjun wore on Instagram in Chicago after he used them. Clarence Angelo. And today we're talking about K hey, Poppity Poppity Boom. <laughs> Poppity Poppity Boom. <laughs> Can y'all stop? Wait, it's not. It's our fault. We haven't seen each other. I know. There's so much has happened. Yeah. And, and obviously we're eating today because uh, we don't eat dinner until we <laughs> Yeah, let's just get into it. Uh, today's drink uh, is Kimbo Young Juice. That sounds like a fucking name. Young Jun. Young Jun. <laughs> shall we? We shall. Me when I see Jungkook. This episode of Asian Glow Podcast is sponsored by Ana Luisa. Bing, bing, bing. Ana Luisa is a 100% carbon neutral jewelry brand based out of New York. And their stuff is genuinely, for lack of a marketing slogan, their stuff is genuinely slay. <laughs> but I just wanted to show you guys how well these girlies are holding up. As you guys know, I go to concerts all the time. I recently went to Lollapalooza. <laughs> I was wearing this in the vlog literally the entire time. Like it rained at Lollapalooza. Also, like when you're watching TXT and New Jeans and, and people do all of them and you're literally crying and you want to literally die. But like also I love them. When all of those emotions are going on, you're like, I'm sweating. And a lot of times when you sweat jewelry, it starts to tarnish. Literally leaving your skin looking green, girl. My Ana Luisa stuff, it's lasted the span of time. And then I also have this rope ring here. A big sled, yes. She's doing just fine. No green fingering. What? Also, you guys know I've been very busy recently with a lot of dance stuff. I go to dance rehearsals every day. Um, I also perform two to three times a month. And I have like a little lucky charm. Can you see it? Can you can you see it? See? Can you see it? <laughs> That's so cute. That's my lucky charm. And I promise you, like, yes, of course, I sweat a lot when I go to concerts. But girl, do I sweat when I perform? I literally hop in the shower with it on. It's all fine. I don't have to stress about it being ugly when I wake up. Having this lucky charm as something that can withstand time is you know it's dope all my Anna Louise jewelry is doing just fine if anything now they have like memories attached to them so they're only getting better ditch having to get like a million little temporary pieces and think about the long term with your jewelry so take your first step towards a non-stressful jewelry experience with Anna Louisa at the link in my description as well as using my discount code found here once again thank you to Anna Louisa for sponsoring this episode of Asian Globe podcast I love you guys okay what are we eating today Corn dogs yeah, uh, from OK Dog. Corn dog from OK Dog. And then we also got. Camera eats first. <laughs> Birth control. <laughs> this looks so dry. Wait, you, you like... just gotta mix it up. You just gotta mix yeah. it up. Mix it, it up. Mix it up. Mix it up. No. It's, it started. Dude, I always try to make our fucking mukbangs look good, but they just end up looking so fucking middle class. Cause what are we? The fucking whole country ketchup. <laughs> Cause it looks middle class. Maybe because you bought Hill Country. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. I'm so stupid. I forgot the lactate. <laughs> Ew. No. What? You took that pill raw. You're supposed to. It's chewable. Ew. That's still fucking insane, bitch. Uh, what? What do you want me to swallow? You're like, mm, snack time. You're gonna take a Tylenol dry like that? No one said anything about no that. No lube. <laughs> You're taking a Tylenol without lube. The sweet potato eats some. We're getting quite creative with the, what's what's four plus four? But it's like now like, like what's ETA backwards? Oh my god, that was so good. Whoever commented that, um, I was like, what's older sister in Tagalog? I was like, oh I was like, my I was like, god. Out there? And someone said, how many letters are there in Super Shy? Mm -hmm. I was like, oh my god. 
I think we should step it up, girls. What's two times twenty-four minus forty-seven plus seven? <laughs> Full pem dollars on these bitches, girl. That was crazy. What's two times fifty minus fifty minus twenty-four minus uh minus thirteen minus five? Hmm. Wait, what? Four. Let me tell my young coconut juice. Oh, oh my god! Oh. I love being Asian, bro. <laughs> <laughs> bro, Asian people are so fine, bro. How you been, bitch? I'm 22. Ah! Are you actually? Yeah. Oh, wait, I have your birthday gift. Anyway, I went to Japan. Can you tell? <laughs> Did you go to the crossing? Yes. Okay. Did you gritty? No, I was really close to it, but then my- Ah, oh, the urge my... to gritty is so strong. I know. Oh, I, just... I can't fight it. I just want to fucking gritty fucking everywhere. <laughs> like, I want to gritty on the fucking sidewalks. I want to gritty on the Shibuya crossing. Oh, I love grittying. I did gritty on the Tokyo tonight. Tower. <laughs> did you see that? No, I gritty on the part where like it's glass. Yes. That's bold. No, that's it a was... bold gritty girl. That's a crazy fucking gritty. <laughs> Good gritty. Um, Good shout gritty. out to shout out, shout out to the girlie that said hi to me in the airport. That's insane. I was running to get the last matcha ice cream that I could in the airport. And I was the like, fan I had, had it, and she goes, "Fuck." Yeah, she goes, "Oh, you're all Cheska." <laughs> Put it in my face. <laughs> she was so cute. Her mom was like, oh my god. I would move to Japan if the work culture, culture wasn't so terrible. I know. I'm watching this be up. <laughs> Go ahead and, and, and rewind. Listen. <laughs> I'm drooling over this BL. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's like those two boys in Japan, they like hate their lives, but they bond over the fact that they hate their lives. I had the best ramen of my life underground. Mm. I was like, this is the best ramen I've ever had in my entire and fucking life, nothing... and it was only $9. Yeah, girl. That's just pretty expensive, actually, for Japan. I just know how fresh it is. It... Like, oh, so, so good. good. The fucking so meat good. was like, anywhere you went, it was insane. I know. And I was like, why is this giving like high quality meat? Like, I know. In America, it's the best meat in my mouth I've ever had. Oh. Anyway, how are you? <laughs> <laughs> it's dance season now for me. So if you're going to fucking World of Dance Houston, and you're competing in that, I'll be there. And then I just got back um, from La La Palooza. Can you tell? Let me see. The top one. Tubin. What's this Philippine. one? Philippines. <laughs> oh. Wait, wait. <laughs> this one was given to me by someone. <laughs> You need to rip that off and no, then burn it. No, this is given by someone who listens oh, to- <laughs> Where's mine? Where's mine? I was like walking around at Sabrina Carpenter and this girl found me and she was like, Oh my God, I made something for you. And then I went back to my friend group and he goes, Who gave you that? <laughs> and I was like, Oh, this girl who like listens to podcasts. She was so cute. And then he was like, How fucking funny would it be if you said like a white man gave you that? He was like, Oh, I found one. <laughs> I found a Filipino. Like a Pokemon. Yeah. I found one. Give it to him. So I got the Filipino one. The last one says, Ate. <laughs> Biba. I ran out of bees. Yeah, Biba and so it was like bee. we were gonna say Biba Dookie, <laughs> <laughs> but then I was like, ah, I can't do her like that. Standout performance, Sabrina Carpenter. Yeah. I told you in the car. Yeah. She's a star. She's a star. And if she was on Y2K or whatever that fucking JYP show is. JYP would be like, you're a star. Joshua Bassett is wrong for that. I'm kidding, I love his music too, so I like. I saw Nikki. Do you, you, do you know your Nikki? I know, I know my Nikki eighty eight rising. Yeah. I know I fucking. I know Nicole Zefania. Yeah, I don't know, I don't know fucking Sri Lanka, but I know fucking <laughs> Nicole Zefania. <laughs> I went to high school in Jakarta. <laughs> Last two, of course, Marina Sawayama. Stop. In fucking sane. I love Rina her. Sawayama. Say the fucking name, bitch. I know. Say the name. Oh, uh, I saw the cutest like, Gaijin couple. Aww. It was so fucking Gaijin cute. is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> and then, of course, bitch, last thing, I promise, fucking TXT was fantastic. Okay, stop. Like, I don't, genuinely, I don't even want to. <laughs> like, I'm so sorry. Call it dramatic? I don't want to know. Okay, but like, how did you get <laughs> There was a fucking, like, I don't want to say, I don't want to make it racist, but like. Okay, don't. <laughs> don't. But, no, no, no. Like, I don't know if it was race based, but like, there was just like this instance that happened. Before Tick T was uh, Maggie Rogers. <gasps> no way. Fantastic. Half of my friends just so happened to be Maggie Rogers, like, stands. Oh. So they were having fun of life. And then when Maggie Rogers came out, everyone obviously lifted their light sticks. Like, mm -hmm. and we're like, yeah, like, whatever, mm -hmm. whatever. And when we did that, this like group of white girls was just like not vibing with us. I don't, I wouldn't say all of them weren't vibing with us. It was just like, you know, a few that we would hear like kind of snarky 
oh. comments on us. We were like raising our light stick, and then we heard her say like, "Oh, these fucking light sticks are in the way, like whatever." Yeah. But she said these fucking K-pop shits are in the way, like whatever. Mm. And I was like, whatever. And then she goes like, when Maggie Rogers is like changing her costume or stuff, or she went to the back to like drink water. Yeah. She was like, "Thanks for sharing your culture, but you can put the stick down." What? I was like, girl, I'm Filipino. Oh my god, <laughs> I would have thrown a punch. Ew! Oh my god. And I was like, whoa, that's crazy. I would have used the last bit of my water to. <laughs> I just genuinely was like, whoa. We were just like me and my friends. We don't just sit there when the, another artist is performing. Like you know, yeah, like I will say, a obviously. lot of Moa were probably not giving her the hype that yeah. she needed. There was a point where Maggie Rogers said, like, um, she was like. Hi guys, like I know you guys are here mostly for like the next act and she goes, yeah. I'm so excited for them too. Yeah. But then the white girl behind us, she goes, No, we're not. Like Maggie, I'm here for you. I would never fucking be here for anyone else. Relax, pick me. Yeah. And I was like, generally think about it. She couldn't hear you, right? Yeah. So you were saying that for everyone for else around yeah. you to hear it and like ruin their experience. Afterwards, like when Maggie Rogers was over, I was like, guys, we should have just like fucked with her because she obviously thought k-pop fans were weird yeah we should have propagated that k-pop <laughs> fans were fucking weird start barking at her <laughs> for, for txt yeah, like, and and you're right pinky toe smells like poopies <laughs> poopy poopy like <laughs> biva dookie <laughs> someone smells like a biva dookie <laughs> my friend was like we should have been like do you even shave your pussy <laughs> <laughs> Ch- 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 <laughs> so every time we go to Lollapalooza we Go to Chinatown. We went to Daebak, which is the <laughs> it's the BTS K pop K barbecue mm-hmm. place. Yeah. And like guys, it's good. So like we didn't, <laughs> so, we didn't fucking go for fucking BTS. We were eating there and like you know how most K barbecue places now are Korean restaurants play like K pop on the TV. Yeah. So we were just like watching these music videos while we were like eating whatever. Mm-hmm. And like no audio, right? Yeah. And we we're like, dude, K pop K pop music videos are fucking crazy They're without weird. audio yeah like if you don't hear the music what the fuck is going on <laughs> like why did leah just fucking land on a forklift <laughs> like what the fuck is going on so he's got me thinking he's got me thinking <laughs> i have an activity we should just like voice over this okay should, let's do it we should dub k-pop music videos <laughs> That are fucking insane. Okay, do you have a music video in, in mind? I do, I do, I do. Don't look, don't look. Don't I'm please not. Please don't, please don't, please don't. Okay. <laughs> God, this is gonna be so bad. Okay, go, go, go. This music video. Okay. Divergent. <laughs> My pussy sings. <laughs> Whoa, her pussy sings. <laughs> no. Ma'am, Mr. Pussy sings. Whoa, whoa, girl. <laughs> Hey, motherfuckers! <laughs> What's good to? Oh, oh, yeah, oh, fuck yeah! I'm gonna fuck you seven days a week. <laughs> I'm gonna yeah. fuck you seven days a week. <laughs> what? I'm gay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Attention, souls, high school. I think girls are super hot. Also, please, can I please hit? <laughs> Bro, that, that thing looks crazy. Wait, wait, go back. <clears throat> Whoa, I like. Oh my god, horse. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, welcome to Key Club. <laughs> Today we're doing community service at the local fucking sex shop. <laughs> if you don't want to go, I'm gonna throw a chair at a wall. <laughs> no, man, I'm so you gotta angry. go. My toxic masculinity is whoa. just. Oh my god. I don't need a sex shop because I have a girl. I'm grabbing your hair, queen. Whoa, whoa, I know whoa. that's a wig. I know that's a wig. No, dude. Hey girl. Hey girl. Do I? Oh. I hate women. Oh, I would kill for this to happen to me. Turn it off. Wait, that wasn't the voiceover. You turn it off. Turn it off. I'll be fucking you, bye. I'm, I'm, I'm the one I should love. Is it? Send me me. In this world. Send me me. I'm a man. I got fear. In the mirror. Monday, Boy, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And finger the air. What I want to do to you. Bring the finger. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Why do you get the worst one? Wait, what do you mean? Ooh, what, what, what? Why do you get the worst one? 
My fucking stomach lining though. The shit is <laughs> burned. Welcome back on break, everyone. Thanks for waiting. I appreciate your patience and would love to circle back with you next time. Looking forward to <laughs> This part of the podcast is a segment we like to call Asians Answer. This part of the podcast is where we answer your questions that you we put on our Instagram story and then you guys give us the responses on Instagram. You know, story, you know, let's go. And then we just answer them. The first question is What is your dream non K pop festival? Set list. Mm, okay. Megan the Stallion. <gasps> Megan the Stallion. No I want to see fucking Megan the Stallion on a Captain Hook that okay. shit. <laughs> Nikki. I need to Idiot see Idiot Rising. Nikki. Yes, I need to see Nikki before ah, I go. My list. There's also someone on my list who got canceled recently, so I cannot say. Ariana. Oh. Guys, to all the girls who liked mm-hmm. Ariana, we, yeah. we're, I'm not cutting this out. I hope y'all are doing okay. Jenea Echo. Oh! oh. Yeah. Uh, let me let me uh, yeah, yeah. I need to see, I need to fucking see Janae Echo. Oh my god. I need to see that bitch. I love her. She is my healing. She is my core. My healing is crazy. I've never seen a human artery personified as a person. She is my human <clears throat> artery. She is feeding blood to my heart. Beyonce! Oh, oh my god, I need to see Beyonce. You're kidding. I need to see Zach the Budlo because I don't know Tagalog, but I learned Tagalog through his music. That's She's crazy. going through her K-pop playlist. Girl, this what this is my top tracks of the month. <laughs> Wait, Stop! Uh, <gasps> Big time rush. <laughs> what? Wait, that was a serious answer. That was not a serious answer. I'm so sorry. What? BTR? BTS. <laughs> Sorry, am I being a hater? I'm not a hater. A I just, bit. I like, like it's crazy. I just like... wouldn't. I it wouldn't like if I saw them on a headliner or something. I'd be like, wow, that's crazy. So, next question. If someone was flirting with me, okay, and I needed you to act like my fake girlfriend, <laughs> what would you do? Like, what would what would you do? Oh my god, no, we can't. I'm okay, gonna POV bomb it. Put yourself at like in a situation. A concert, I guess. A concert? Like, we're at the concert, and then this person's like hitting on me, and I'm like, I okay, okay. don't want to. <laughs> no, literally, I'd be like, I can't! <laughs> I'd be like, I have to go to the bathroom! What would I do? What would I have to do? Okay, like, okay, okay, pretend go. you're at a concert. <laughs> I can't look at you and do it. <laughs> I, can, I can play the part. Okay, okay, go, 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 go. Okay, someone's hitting on you. Babe. <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. Don't ever fucking do that again. You're fucking disgusting. Don't ever get off me. You're fucking gross. <laughs> oh God, oh my God. Is that what your boyfriend sees? No! Because I never. Switch. Okay. Someone's hitting on me. <laughs> oh, shit. A guy, a guy is hitting. Oh. I have a, I have a boyfriend. <laughs> That's what you would do. Sorry, I'm a boyfriend. <laughs> you know what? I'd be like, uh, you're like, sorry, I'm a boyfriend. Full on fucking Jim and shirt on. <laughs> I love you, Jim, and across my face. Sorry, I'm with These my boyfriend. These two in your hand. <laughs> sorry, I'm with my boyfriend. Girl. Oh, was he in the bathroom or something? <laughs> <laughs> okay, what would I okay. do? No, no, sorry. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm with my boyfriend. You're kind of cute. No. <laughs> no way! Not anymore! <laughs> Move, bitch! Cause that was a lie! You no. wouldn't protect me straight <laughs> up! I'll be like... <laughs> yep. Love. 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 The love, making, yeah. love making coochie love. Yeah. <laughs> love is so funny. <laughs> this is my movement. This is my rep. <laughs> this is. Uh. 
What bracelets would you make for idols and what would they say? I'll give you a, a K-pop a K-pop group and then you tell me what you would want to put. If I was going up to Hunakai, twink X together. <laughs> And then matching bracelets. And then if the I was going up to Subin, I would put one half of the handcuffs on him and put the other one on him. <laughs> the bracelet is just handcuffs. <laughs> and then if it was Young June, I would get the bracelet. My number. And then my bra <laughs> <laughs> just my phone number. Social security card on the fucking bag. If I was going up to Jin, also my number. Your bracelet is this. Give me your arm. <laughs> hey, I made this slap bracelet. <laughs> fucking fuck! Fuck! Get her off me, shit! <laughs> and you're like, yes, yes! <laughs> this is getting too far. This is getting too far. End yeah. the question. End this question. Who are the most Filipino idols? Oh, first one. Wait, that, look, wait, look, wait, first look, one that came to mind was was um Jihyo. Okay. From Twice. Kevin is very Filipino to me. Kevin, Kevin from the boys. That's interesting because. <laughs> wait, wait. I last have, one. <laughs> I prepared a I didn't know you're too sexy though. No. <laughs> Pinoy or Pino? <laughs> That's so good. That background is so When I found fun. this, I was like, you're gay. I didn't know there's a flag. <laughs> so the first one that I thought of, or that people We need have. that hung up right there. <laughs> I, <know. laughs> I was thinking this. I was thinking this. Salu Cruz <coughs> from The Boys Wait, Are You I joking? was thinking this, but I was like, ah, no one's gonna know who Salu is. But then, Are you kidding? He's like, on every whenever people talk about this, he's like number one, number two. He looks so Does Filipino. Does he not look so Filipino? Oh, I wish I honestly he looks just like me. <laughs> okay, next one. <laughs> I knew it. What the fuck is on the right? Ate Ryujin Santos, thank you. <laughs> Ate Ryujin Santos. Because Who's that on the right? I don't know. I just looked up Swagapino. <laughs> but don't don't these pictures give off the same energy? Mm -hmm. No. She deserved to be Sunshine Corazon. <laughs> Sunshine Sunjit Corazon. Sunshine Corazon. Ryujin? No. Ri Ikaujin. <laughs> so bad. Ate Yanjin Akino. <laughs> Who needs brain cells when you have swag? Specifically, her pre debut pictures? Girl. Oh, that is very Filipino. Actually. Are these not like the same photo? <laughs> <laughs> And I like, never okay. know what you're about to say. Like, yeah. girl, no wonder she loves Biba Doobie. <coughs> That's her cousin. <laughs> <laughs> she said her best friend was Filipino. She wants to be us. I know, she wants to be us so, so bad. So bad. Bro. Okay. <laughs> Mr. No. Jungkook Bautista. Wait, he looks so fucking Filipino Wait, on the very left. No, genuinely, Wait. like... What? Don't say a word. What? Don't fucking say a word. Don't say a fucking word, bitch. I know exactly what you're gonna say. I know exactly Don't what you're gonna say. Don't say a fucking word. No. No, but you're how kidding. How quick I pulled this out. No, you're kidding. No fucking chance. <laughs> <laughs> that is the same hat. But no. San Francisco. And L. Oh my god. This is really Filipino because it says San Francisco on it. Oh my god. But it's like the same. End. Oh my the end. god. Jungkook's Princess Diana. Jungkook's. By distributive property, I'm Princess Diana. <laughs> distributive property. And therefore, by PEMDAS. I am Jungkook. <laughs> by PEMDAS. That is crazy. Yeah, I was in this phase of putting peace signs up. Wait, and he always put peace signs up. Yes. And Princess Diana always put peace You. You could literally say that about anyone. <laughs> Thank you! Oh my god. I'm so good. I literally have to put this in Tita Jihyo. She's Ate. No, she's literally Ate. Like, I, you can't convince me in any fucking college board essay that she is not Filipino. No, because look at this. And you, then look at this. Is this not the same photo? <laughs> I said this does. This is what white people say. This is what white. I'll trust you. This is what white people say. They're like, hey, look at this Indonesian girl. And then look at this Chinese girl. They're the same. <laughs> Okay, but the energy, it really the is energy from like... the call is coming from inside the house, bitch. <laughs> the call is coming from But they do look alike. <laughs> <laughs> they look so similar, bitch. Last one, I think. Last one, hit. Don't, don't scream. Ooh. <laughs> okay, what are you gonna say? Isn't this crazy? I do not think he, GK is Filipino whatsoever. He sings like a Filipino. <gasps> Thank you. 
sings like a Filipino, that means you're his right. soul is Filipino. That means his soul He sings soul like a is... Filipino. You're just saying that because he has vocals. Wait, exactly. What? Yeah. <laughs> That's You're like, oh, a Korean guy that has vocals. Geo. A what? Korean girl that has vocals. What do all these people have in common? They can, they can kind of sing. <laughs> like, if I go back home and I if, I if I just go out into the street and go, Hoi, DK! I know people are going to be... Oh. That's me. Wait. Yeah. Oi, Donkey Kong. <laughs> Don Quixote, oi. Don Quixote. Um, someone said, not to like defend white people because like, no, but list out things that white people did right. I like the preface of the beginning of this question. Okay. It's like, like, we're not defending them. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I have to fucking say, the colonizers did it right. Tiramisu, bitch. <gasps> I hate that I'm praising them for that. I'm sure they culturally stole that, right? Tiramisu's probably. There's no way a white person made that. No chance, right? I don't wait. What? Is, what culture is tiramisu? Italian. Italian. But they're spicy. Oh shoot! Gelato. Fuck. <laughs> Damn it! These fucking. I really like. Oh man! I really like baguettes with jam and cheese. It is good. Or sh wait, did? Oh um, shut up! What? French fries. Oh, that's like Belgian, right? Yeah, I think. Oh my god. Starbucks. <gasps> You're so dumb. I was literally <coughs> just gonna say the Trenta, the Venti size at yeah. Starbucks. Oh, like anything that's just fucking obnoxiously big. Yes! When, like, okay. like the triple fuck burger from <laughs> <laughs> the triple fuck burger from Burger King and the triple XL burrito shit fuck at Taco Bell. Thank You're you. Right. Thank you, Ryan Smith. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Paul. Karen Jones. Yeah. Thank you, Paul Murderer. Yeah, thank you, George. <laughs> and Paul Murderer. <laughs> Thanks, Christopher Columbus. <laughs> drive through, the concept of drive through. I think just the concept of laziness is fantastic. I know. They America took like laziness or like white people took laziness and, and really capitalized, capitalized on, on it. it. Thank you. You don't need to get out of your car, you piece of shit. Just come in and get this fucking fat yeah. fuck burger. I know. In the comfort of your own fucking drop. I know. Feel worse than you already do. Yeah, shit in that fucking Ford F-150. I know you keep a bottle of your piss in there because you don't want to get up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but also note how there was literally only less than two hands worth <laughs> of good shit. Yeah. I love french fries. I'm such a fries yeah. girl. Thanks. If you're gonna be racist, at least give me a pack of french fries. <laughs> Someone asked how to deal with not feeling as pretty when watching K-pop idols. <gasps> as pretty or handsome, I guess. Yeah. This is fucking real. Yeah. What is your answer? Because you just saw a couple K-pop idols. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I feel like I'm like at the point where I'm like, you guys are like untouchably like That's, attractive. I have to always like remind myself that because I'm like. That mm. phase cost thousands of dollars yeah and i'm like as it should because like they're yeah. they're literally an idol like this is yeah. their job and, and this is what they like train for and stuff and then <laughs> all like the makeup artists and costume designers whatever managers like made this person yeah. look but the way they are the thing is a lot of times when people are like they're like oh that face costs so much or like they have so much makeup yeah and then people start to get even more insecure because they're like oh i i don't have access to that kind of shit especially as fucking filipinos bro yeah. like skin fairness is I like a, a very big thing i have a cousin he doesn't go swimming mm. because he doesn't want to get dark and i was like dude no matter how much you stay inside you're never gonna be that fair. yeah right like you're never gonna be that fair yeah it's fucking melanin it's not like you're tanning yeah and it's not a bad thing to have melanin dude if you think it's a bad thing that's it's like a battle you have to fight. It definitely is like going to the Philippines and then like when you walk off the plane, a billboard of like a skin yeah. whitening. I would like go into a Jollibee and then they would have like a picture like on, like spread across the entire wall. And then there, there was like two Asian people in it and they weren't even Filipino. And Dude, if they were, then they were half. So, so it's hard to yeah, not compare so, yourself. But let's not like spiral here. Yeah. Genuinely, first thing you have to come to terms with, you're wasting your fucking time. Like for example, yeah. my cousin, you're wasting your fucking time not swimming with your friends. You're wasting yeah. your fucking time not enjoying life because of whatever. Like, you think you're not going to get a girlfriend. You think you're not going to get a boyfriend because you're too fucking dark. Yeah. That girl that likes you because you're pale is not the girl you want to fucking be with anyways. Exactly. That guy that likes you because you're pale is not the guy you want to be with fucking anyways. Yeah. Because the second you grow up yeah. and you get some extra sun, you're going to be stressed about that guy still liking you. Yeah. Fuck that life. No, yeah. Fuck that fucking life. You got to think long term. This is actually helpful look up that idol or look up that actor that you like 
idolize or whatever, yeah. look up their fucking high school pictures. <gasps> exactly. There is no chance they look anywhere near yeah. what they look like now. Yeah. Like that yeah. one picture of Felix. People give him so much shit for that picture. Yeah. I was like, boy, if I saw that kid in high school, I'd be like, that's a beautiful man. Yes. Like, if that kid was in your high school, that's a beautiful man. Yeah. That's true. Yeah. That's a... Good, good piece of advice. Uh, well, that's the end of today's episode. Episode 19, bitch. Because mm-hmm. you know what was episode 18? Bling, 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 bling. Hey! That's on our audio. Yeah. Thank you to everyone who said hi at Lala Palooza. Also, bitch, the Asian Podcast account hit 150. <gasps> yeah! 150K. Y'all remember what I was going to do at 200K? Be pick moan sounds. But anyways, actually, thank you for 150K. That's fucking crazy. If you're watching this, and you're not already subscribed, could you, could you just please click it? Can you please, like, I'm being so serious. It's like, not that hard. It's really it's not that literally hard. Not. It just helps us get go to, like, events and things. Like, I know recently we... Yeah, we got comments that say, why aren't y'all at KCON? You tell us! No, <laughs> I, go, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a shit about no subscriber count. But it does help with, like, you know, our growth and stuff. If you want the extended version of this podcast, it's on audio streaming platforms. Mm-hmm. So go ahead on there, and usually we just add, like, a few more things that we cut out mm-hmm. for video. We're gonna end the podcast like we normally do in our respective language. Isa, Dalawa, Tatlo, Inga, Girls like me. How was yours for the taking? Guess I needed a home. Carve my name into his butt cheeks. Jeez. Next time we'll think before I quit. <laughs>